Hi everyone, welcome in, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Emmy. It's so good to have you here because today we are watching the highly anticipated Star Wars Rogue One movie and I am so freaking excited. So if any of you are new to my channel or you didn't already know, I am watching Star Wars in the timeline order. So all movies I've seen so far have just been the prequels and Solo. I've of course been watching Clone Wars in the background. I plan to continue that but I'm going to continue on with the movies especially since Andor is going to come out at the end of September I want to watch Rogue One so I'm kind of on the same page as everyone else is going into that series I have literally no idea what to expect of Rogue One besides the fact that I hear so much about it I mean a lot of you guys have been anticipating my reaction to it so I think it's gonna be a great movie I hope so at least and yeah we're just gonna go ahead and get into it I'm very eager if you aren't already subscribed, I would really appreciate that. And of course, a thumbs up is super appreciated as well. And let's go. And today we have special guest Lily the Beagle Baby to join us for this movie. She was here for Iron Man as well. She left about halfway through. So let's see if she likes Rogue One better. A long time ago in a galaxy far away. What is that? Oh, it's a planet. Okay, right off the bat, this is kind of a crazy movie to get into because you can tell it was made more recently than the other movies. I mean, that shot alone is pretty beautiful. <laughs> Who's this young whippersnapper? Mama! We know. Jin, get their faces. Jin? Remember, whatever I do, I do it to protect you. So you understand? I understand. What's about to happen? It doesn't seem good, whatever it is. Go. Oh no. Why are they after them? You know where to go, don't you? We're getting separated? The mom's not even gonna go Trust with her? Trust the Force. Trust the Force? Is she a Jedi then? Or is that just like a common saying? Who's that? It's a peaceful life. It's lonely, I imagine. Since Leo died, yes. Oh, he's lying to protect his family. Because we just saw her. My condolences. Search the house. <laughs> yeah, that's how you show condolences. We were this close to providing peace and security for the galaxy. You're confusing peace with terror. Well... A lot of people in Star Wars tend to do that. No, I admire the effort, I really do. Oh god. Oh, look, here's Lyra back from the Oh no! It's a miracle. Why did she go back? Shouldn't they have had their stories together? You're not taking him! No, of course I'm not. I'm taking you all. They probably planned it and Lyra seems like she's not the kind of person to just sit by and do nothing. Think very carefully. Oh god, and this kid is watching. Do it. Oh, and the little girl has to see that. Girlie, you were supposed to get out of there. Find it! It? Find it? Wow. Shows how heartless they are to refer to a human child as it. I mean, regardless if they knew the gender or not, you don't say it, you could have said them. Seems like a good hiding place. So Jin must be our protagonist of the movie. What does she even do now? Does she have any other family or somewhere to go? Oh, this guy. <laughs> I didn't even realize that the title didn't play yet. Oh, this music. This is a remix. I like it. Some years later. I'm guessing that's Jin. Oh, oh my. Talk about roommate horror stories, am I right? <laughs> You're worried about a roommate who snores? 
She's worried about a roommate who looks like that in the snores. Oh, so she ended up getting captured anyways. Ring of coffering? Trading outpost, okay. I like that they label places like that. Who's this feller? An Imperial pilot. One of the cargo drivers he defected yesterday. He's telling people- Who? What kind of weapon? Look, I have to go! What kind of weapon? A planet killer! A planet killer? Planet killer. Yeah, that can't be good. Saw's right. There's spies everywhere. <laughs> What's all this? Uh, speaking of spies. Yeah, of course. Just my gloves. <laughs> <laughs> Smooth. No! What have you got? What do you mean, no? He clearly doesn't have documents. What was he supposed to do? I'll never climb out of here on my arm! This guy's stressing me out. He's not making sense. He's really not helping the situation. In fact, he's making it worse. We'll be alright. Huh? What? <laughs> I mean, clearly me and him had the same train of thought but i wasn't like that annoyed with him i wasn't saying kill him but he really was making the situation worse i like the music nah. we're in the middle of nowhere we need to get to jeddah city what part of urgent message do you guys not understand what is happening whoa is that like an old statue or did somebody like shape the rock to look like a person there's a lot going on already we're like cutting from place to place people to people hey that's our roommate and they were roommates whoa is this the guy we just saw whoa congratulations you are being rescued what Okay, that punch you just threw me and body slammed me to the ground did not feel like rescuing. Rebel Alliance headquarters. We got an R2-D2 wannabe. Imagine if the Imperial authorities had found out who you really were, Jin Erso. How do they figure that out? Also, I recognize him. How do I know him? Oh, I know him from Sex Education, the Netflix show. He's the principal in that movie. Or the headmaster, whatever it's called. It's been a long time. But he'll remember you, though. Who is the Saw guy? Everyone's asking about him. I was a child. Saw Guerrero saved my life. He raised me, but I've no oh, idea where he is. Oh, I haven't okay. seen him. So that was the guy who said, come here, child. He's claiming the Emperor is creating a weapon the power to destroy entire planets. So her father could have made the technology for that? We need to stop this weapon before it is finished. Captain Andor's mission is to authenticate the pilot's story. Captain and Andor! Find your that's the show that's coming out. Captain Andor! Oh, that's Captain Andor. I missed that. <laughs> All right, cool. I'm K2SO. I'm a reprogrammed Imperial droid. Oh yeah, you're the one that body slammed me. What do I know? My specialty is just strategic analysis. Hmm. So he knows a lot, that bot. He tends to say whatever comes into his circuits. It's a <laughs> byproduct of the reprogram. Why does she get a blaster and I don't? <laughs> oh yay, another droid with a personality. Where'd you get it? I found it. I find that answer vague and unconvincing. <laughs> Trust goes both ways. But she is right. Trust does go both ways. The only way that he's going to earn her trust is by giving her a little bit of trust as well. Noise! Oh, this is Saw. Uh, as for you. And I gave it to them. They did not find it. So this Saw guy must be really powerful, and a lot of people are trying to either fight against him or try to get on his side. What's that? What's that breathing stuff you need? What? Poor Gullet. 
Borgullet. What does that mean? What or who is Borgullet? Also, why did he need a mask to breathe? That ship looks really cool. It looks like a Lego. Speaking of which, I'm working on my Lego Darth Vader. Okay, back to the movie. We've heard word of rumors Whoa. The city. He looks so evil, he looks like a cartoon. Well, aren't these guys just having a jolly time? What's the matter, Jim? Oh, afraid. flashback. I was hoping that we would get some information of what happened in between. Huh. So her dad used to work for them. That's Jedha. Man, you would think with how many people have ships in Star Wars that there would be more traffic in space. I feel like there's yet to be an episode or a movie about space traffic. <laughs> that could cause real problems. Maybe they just better structured their highways than us. What are they taking out? Kyber crystal. Holding. Oh. Ample. So that'll no, we know. power the weapon? The fuel for the weapon. Yeah. Okay. We're on the same page. I understand what's going on now. Leave target practice behind. Are you talking about me? <laughs> I'm just worried they might miss you. And hit me. <laughs> Doesn't sound so bad to me. <laughs> Aww. We like him, though. That's poor Gullet. What on earth? I can feel your thoughts. Uh, I don't like that. No lie is safe. Man, that guy has trust issues. What have you really brought me? Ew, get your tentacles off of me. Borgullet will know the truth. Let's hope this guy was the telling the truth. Side effect is that one tends to lose one's mind. Oh, what? So even if he is telling the truth, his mind is gonna be all scrambled after? That's cool. I didn't realize that there was like a city there. Is that Boar Gullet's son? I'm just kidding. We don't eat Boar Gullets. Trade that necklace for a glimpse into your future. Yes. I'm speaking to you. Oh. How do you know I'm wearing a necklace? I'm Chira Inwin. How did you know I was wearing a necklace? That's what I'm wondering. He said they powered the Jedi's lightsabers. Jin, come on, let's go. Yeah, we gotta go. You, you seem all pretty tense all of a sudden. We have to hurry. This town is ready to blow. What do you mean by that? Oh God. They have like snipers everywhere. Yeah. Oh, this is scary. <gasps> oh my god! Y'all gotta get out of there. He was absolutely right, it is about to blow. Looks like we found Sol's rebel. Good thing she had a gun. <gasps> Stop! Don't bring the child into this. You have to save the child. Good, I'm proud of Jin. Good. Baby safe. Oh. Oh my god. So much is happening. <laughs> that was casual. They're stealing all the crystal. This way. How is everyone missing? I swear none of these people do aim practice. Like Jin was literally just out in the open 
without a weapon even fold for a second. <laughs> Wait, is that our friend? Oh god. You okay. That, wasn't me? that was so scary. <laughs> I'm so happy that wasn't him. That was so scary. For two people blending in. <laughs> we like this droid so much. He just saved our necks. Halt. Stop right there. Mm, what if I just keep going? Where are you taking these prisoners? These are prisoners. Yes, where are you taking them? <laughs> I am taking them to imprison them <laughs> in prison. Nice. Yes. Sold. Again. We'll take them from here. That's okay. If you could just point me in the right direction, I can take them, I'm sure. I've taken oh them this God. far. Oh, God. Take them away. Wait. You can't take them away. Oh, no. no stay here. We need to check no. your diagnostics. No. You don't. I'm capable of running my own diagnostics. Thank you very much. Yeah. Learn pass in peace. Oh, this is a guy. And I fear nothing for all this. Oh, Lily has had enough of Rogue One. Ooh, this guy is giving me Toph from Avatar vibes in that he's blind, but the rest of his senses are very heightened. Also, yes. Oh my God. Right when he started doing this like martial arts, I was like, I think I recognize this man. And he's from the movies Ip Man, which if y'all haven't seen those movies, they are so, so good. This guy's great. This is cool. This is like Ip Man meets Star Wars. I'm actually like so into this now. I love Ip Man and I really love this character in this movie so far. There are no Jedi here anymore. Only dreamers like this fool. <laughs> the Force did protect me. I protected you. <laughs> but in a way, that's the Force. Can't you see? God, so many enemies. Anyone who kills me and my friends will answer to Saw Gerrera. Kaji Kena. Because I'm the daughter of Galen Erso. Hell yeah. Are you kidding me? I'm blind. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> really? I want with the force, the force of me. I want with the force. His brain for the door to open. It bothers him because he knows it's possible. Space <laughs> Morbus. <laughs> was once the most devoted guardian of us all. I'm beginning to think the Force and I have different priorities. So they're thinking of the Force as sort of like something that you can believe in, like a manifesting power, I think. Jen. Oh, I wonder how it's long really it's been you? since they've seen each other. Are we not still friends? I don't know, Saw. You seem like you're up to something. Don't tell me to wait in the bunker till daylight. I knew you were safe. You left me behind. Oh. Not a day goes by that I don't think of you. Okay. I guess I maybe believe that. It's a trap, isn't it? <laughs> what do you mean? The pilot. The message. All of it. Well, kind of. She isn't here on her own free will, that's for sure. Did you come here to kill me? There's not much of me left. Yeah, what's wrong with him? They think he sent you a message about a weapon. I guess they think by sending me, you might actually help them out. At least she's being honest. They wanted an introduction, they've got it. I'm out now. The rest of you can do what you want. Fair. You can stand to see the Imperial flag rain across the galaxy it's not a problem if you don't look up well it is when it literally affects your daily life that's like when people say that they don't involve themselves in politics you like can't do that anymore but i get why she feels that way because it really has been her whole life causing her pain all imperial forces have been evacuated and i stand ready to destroy the entire moon the entire moon target jetta city prepare single reactor ignition they're just gonna blow it up? What? What's anyone gonna do? An imperial pilot. Oh. Is his mind okay? Are you the pilot? 
No, dude's not okay. What's wrong with him? A lot. <laughs> he saw an octopus, dude. The pilot. Wow, he's just now remembering. At least he can get his memories back. I thought he was just gonna have amnesia forever. Perhaps there's a chance to explain myself, and though I don't dare hope for too much, a chance for Jen. That's him. To let her know that my love for her has never faded. Oh my god. What would it be like to see that message? So I did the one thing nobody expected. I lied. I learned to lie. Okay. And all the while, I laid the groundwork of my revenge. We call it the death star. <gasps> the death no star? I know that word. <laughs> but Jen, Jen, if you're listening, my beloved. It's gonna explode, so isn't it? Before we get to the secret. I try to think of you only in the moments when I'm strong because the oh. pain of not having you with me. Your mother, our family, oh. the pain of that. I'm so happy she has this moment. Think of where you are. Stop. The reactor module, that's the key. That's the place I've laid my trap. Okay. It's well hidden and unstable. One blast to any part of it will destroy the entire station. Oh my god. The module will set off a chain reaction that will destroy the entire station. Oh god. Whoa. The way that the moon looks as well. Or the sun, I don't freaking know. Star Wars astronomy. Go, go. Look, and the door open because of the force. Although there's a problem on the horizon. Yes, there is. There's no horizon. <laughs> All right. I'll get the <gasps> Don't kill him. He doesn't know anything. This guy's so freaking cool. Oh, no. No, no, no. Oh, okay, good. Good. He scared me for a second. We just want to leave. Everyone wants to be safe and alive. You must go. Okay. Come with us. I will run no longer. <gasps> saw. Especially now that we just realize that Saw actually is a good person. I'm sad. Save the dream. Oh, poor Saw. He really isn't in any kind of condition to be running, though. He's right. This dude is not okay. <laughs> What's he doing? Oh, wow. What a way for him to go out. Whoa. That is such a huge explosion. You know, I am so happy that Jin got to learn that her father really did do the best thing that he could think of for his family. And he was able to get that message to her. And apparently he's still alive. Stand here amidst my achievement, not yours. I'm afraid- <laughs> They're arguing like children. I wanna see about this. I don't like these guys at all. We have no idea what he's building for the Empire. We have to kill Galen Erso while we have the chance. Wow. Do we though? Because he also told us how to destroy it. Tell me. All of it. The whole city. Oh, because he can't even see. Tell That's rough to have to like say it out loud. That really makes it even more real. He said I could make it right if I was brave enough. To listen to wars in my heart. Oh. Do something about it. Guess it was too late. No, it wasn't. It wasn't too late. Yeah. Tim's pretty late to me. Okay, well, stop. Negative Nancy in the corner. You have that message, right? Everything happened so fast. Why isn't she sharing? I believe her. That's good to know. <laughs> they have to know there's a way to destroy this thing. Yeah. I have to go to Scarish to get the plants. I can't risk sending that. We're in the heart of the That's true. Because if the wrong people find out, that's bad news. And he can tell them himself. 
Okay. So even though he's been told to kill him, kinda need him. And he seems like a good guy, so kinda nervous. There's a 26% chance of failure. How much further? I, I don't know, I'm not sure. I never really come this way, but we're close. We're close. I, I would be so well, stressed if somebody I don't wanna know. Thank <laughs> if somebody was telling me those percentages exactly, I don't wanna know that. So are we okay? Is everyone okay? Now, okay, yeah. Out. Just not the ship. You were the messenger. That's ridiculous. We all got the message. Everyone here knows. Yeah. The rise and see what's what. He senses something. He knows that he's lying or hiding something. I think that's why he doesn't want her to come. Does he look like a killer? No. He has the face of a friend. Who are you talking about? Captain Andor. Yeah. Ip Man knows. The force moves darkly near a creature that's about to kill. Ooh. His weapon was in the sniper configuration. <gasps> it's nice that they're on her side. I mean, obviously he's just doing what he's told. And I wouldn't write him off as a bad guy because as he said, he has a face of a friend. But he's about to do something wrong. What are they doing? If Cassian comes back, we're leaving without them. Hopefully they don't leave without them. <laughs> See her so out there? Yeah, can you distinguish from there? I can't and I have LASIK. Is that him? That's okay, him. I could tell yeah, I could tell that too. In the dark suit. <laughs> Convenient that he's the only one wearing a dark suit. Makes it much easier to distinguish. Came up here just to have a look. I'm here. I'm looking. Go. Wow. Right. Now he knows something's up too. He's gonna try and take the shot. Is that all of them? Yes. Oh no! Somebody interrupt him. Betrayed the Empire. One of you has conspired with a pilot. Wow. To send of and it was Galen. Come on, don't do it. If he steps forward, it's a sure shot. Very well, I'll consider it a group effort then. Ready? <gasps> no, 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 Galen. Galen. Dude. It was me. Oh my god. He did it to save all those people. You better stop. Stop. Where's Jin? Yeah, think about Jin. He's a good guy and you know it. Fire! What? <laughs> what? Why did he do that? Why did he do that? Maybe to cover his own ass when they ask who did it? He could just blame it on those people instead of somebody that he should have known would be against him. You'll never win. Now where have I heard that before? Oh, that was when he captured him is when he said that before. Oh my god. <gasps> he sees her. No. No. Did he die? He was really close to that. Okay, so Jin's okay. We don't care about him. Honestly, just put him in the fire. What are you doing? What? I'm sorry. What? He can do that as a blind man? That's so cool. He's a real star of this movie. Oh my god. Oh my god. What? That was very unnecessary. No. Papa, it's me. Dad. No. It's Jin. Jim. Stardust. Stop. Don't say Stardust. It must be destroyed. I know. I know. We will. Jim. No. It's been so long. I have so much to tell you. Yeah, and I don't know if you'll be able to. 
No, stop. Stop. What awful last words. Are you kidding me? No. That is gut-wrenching. The last words being, I have so much to tell you, and then you can't say anything? No. Come on, come on. Listen to me. He's gone. I wonder if she's going to find out that he also tried to kill him. You lied to me. Hmm. You're in shock. I'm glad they are addressing it. You went up there to kill my father. Yep. You don't know what you're talking about. Come on, be honest, dude. I had every chance to pull the trigger. But did I? At least he did have a change of heart. I had orders. Orders that I disobeyed. But you wouldn't understand that. Orders? When you know they're wrong. Hmm. He might as well be a stormtrooper. Oof. She has so much distrust for both sides, and honestly, it's so justified from everything she's experiencing. Who is this? My lord, Director Credic has arrived. Oh. <gasps> Wait, oh! <laughs> I didn't realize Anakin's in the freaking tank. Yeah, I, I was beginning to wonder when this guy was going to show up. Fashionably late, as always. And we have Darth Vader! I missed him. What does that say about me? That's like kind of concerning for me. <laughs> I But I just really think Darth Vader is becoming one of my favorite villains of all time. No, just... Pressed for time, there's a great many things to attend to. My apologies. <laughs> it's remarkable potential. Its power to create problems has certainly been confirmed. Yeah. The Senate has been informed that Jeddah was destroyed in a mining disaster. Okay. The Galen Urso has not compromised this weapon in any way. Well, unfortunately, that's not the truth. You'll speak to the Emperor about it. <gasps> oh my god. Vader didn't even turn around to do that. Be careful not to choke on your aspirations. Oh. <laughs> wow. It's getting exciting. <laughs> if that's how it's going. Why having the lies at all? If she's telling the truth. We need to act now. There are just too many opinions right now. What benefit would it bring him? To lure our forces into a final battle to destroy us once and for all. Yes. Hmm. Everything. I could see that thinking too. You give way to an enemy this evil with this much power and you condemn the galaxy to an eternity of submission. Yeah, and that means so much coming from her too. What is she proposing? <laughs> that guy had the same energy as the person from the Mean Girls that goes, she doesn't even go to the school. <laughs> any hope of destroying it also isn't that i don't remember his name but isn't that leia's father adoptive father I say the rebellion is finished. well let's take a democratic vote i'm sorry Jim. oh okay we don't do that here oh she did get people on her side would like to volunteer yay some of us, most of us. That's heartwarming. We can go. Hey, you're up. You're up. And Yay. I'll be there for you. Cassian said I had to. <laughs> I like their enemies, frenemies things going on. That's funny to have with a droid. May the force be with us. He's like, heck yeah. Now you're getting the Force stuff. So it's almost like when they say, may the Force be with us, it's like, may God be with us. It's almost like a prayer. Come on. Rogue? Rogue! Rogue One. Rogue One? There is no Rogue One. Well, there is now. Yeah, there is now. And it's us. Amazing. I didn't even think about the name of the movie until just now. I completely forgot. I always love that moment in movies or TV shows when they drop the name of the title. He served me well during the Clone Wars and has lived in hiding since the Emperor's Purge. Yes, I will send him. <gasps> you and me someone you can trust. Obi-Wan? Is it Obi-Wan? I trust her with my life. 
Her. Trust her? Who is it? Let me think. I don't know. I'm still only season four of the Clone Wars. Not me. I can survive in space. Well, good for you. Have fun in space by yourself when we all die. Is that a kyber crystal? And maybe that's how that guy could sense it even though he was blind. That looks so cool. Also, I like that our ship is kind of reminiscent of a sea turtle. And the next. On and on until we win. Or the chances are spent. Fair enough. Pal, base cheer it. You'll take the main squad. Move east and get wide of the ship. Find a position between here and the tower. I hope it man doesn't die. What should I do? Keep the engine running. You're our only way out of here. That's true. Pilots are very important. It's a getaway driver. Wow, this place looks cool though. Be prepared to receive inspection team. Ready? I'm scared. I'm not ready. Probably looking for a manifest. That would be helpful. It's just down here. <laughs> I want to see that play out. Good luck, little sister. Aww, I like him. We made some good friends in this movie, specifically the two guys of the temple. Got a bad feeling about me. Okay. Quiet. <laughs> That's a cool transport thing. I like that. Whoa, look at those waterfalls. This is a beautiful place. That's a tall one, right? That one was taller than usual, K3, right? Not them just gossiping. Y'all, this guy is so freaking cool. He's cool too, just in a different way. I like the martial arts aspect. What the? This is literally like part of it, man. Well, dang! Is he loading that one with like his programming? Because that would be nice to have two of them on their side. I love how that man can use a weapon even though he's blind. We will make it no more than 33% of the way before we are killed. Oh, great. Love to know the statistics. It's probably why I failed psych stats like twice in college. Ooh. Whoa. He's like, no, wait a dang minute. <laughs> He's like, how did you guys know it was my birthday? We're having fireworks for my birthday. Blind? Deploy the Him asking if they're blind is funny because a blind man is actually doing better. Troopers, troopers on the left. Get in, get in. Ooh, I love how they just are running right past them. <laughs> Amazing. Prepare for the jump to hyperspace and inform Lord Vader. Ooh, Lord Vader will not be pleased. <laughs> the force really runs through that guy. Alright, we got the reinforcements coming in. That's our homies! That's my baby! That's my little R2-D2! And C-3PO, I guess. But R2-D2! This is pad two, pad two. I spot 40 rebels heading west on pad two. Get on there, tell me, <laughs> down by on pad four. Clever. Oh, that's so clever to use their communication against them. Whoa. Oh my god. What is that thing? That's terrifying. 
Oh, here's a little bit of traffic. A little bit of traffic jam. Get to the surface before they close that gate. Copy you, Admiral. Blue Squadron on me. Copy, Blue Leader. They can get in. Okay. At least we're getting some guys in. Come on. Oh my god. I was not expecting that. Are they okay? They've closed the shield gate. What does that mean? We trapped? Yeah, they're keeping the fight here. It makes sense. It's the size of the data files. That's the problem. They'll never get through. Hmm. Someone has to take that shield gate down. Buddy. How? I can't. I'm not I'm not hooked into the to the comms tower. We're, we're not we're not tied in. It's the only way we're getting them out of here. Find a way. How is he gonna Call do that? Out. I feel like Bodhi's gonna sacrifice himself, and I'm scared. Your behavior, Janasso, is continually unexpected. Oh, that's cute. God. Especially because he can like determine that. That's what he's programmed for is probability. I really love their enemies, the friends. Yeah, that thing is just too big. It's kind of cute looking. I'm sad it's a mean guy. <laughs> you have to get on the radio. Get one of the guys out there to find a, a master switch. Get them to activate the connection between us and that comms tower. Don't go! Okay. I'm still very nervous for Bodhi. Your frequencies are blocked. Keep trying. Engage those. That's a cool chair. <laughs> Oh, smart to take out the legs. I can locate the tape, but you'll need to use the handles for extraction. Okay. What is this like a claw to... game? Oh. Like in arcades? No way. That seems too difficult. They went over there. Okay, what's going on out there? Hey, There's come one. on. Oh, well. Don't blow his cover. Nice though. Good job. <gasps> nice. Good thing you had that. How? Please advise. There's a master switch at the base of the comm tower. Master switch. Describe. What are we looking for? What does it look like? Like a light switch? Oh, So brave. Navigational systems. Two screens down. Structural engineering. Open that one. <laughs> Easy. War mantle, cluster prism, black saber. What? Stardust. Stardust! It's that one. That's it? Yep. How do you know that? Cuz. I know because it's me. Yeah. Duh. Hey, you. Identify yourself. I... I don't think things are gonna end. Well. Oh. I thought Bodhi was dead for sure. Be careful, Kay. If Kay dies too, I'll be sad. That looks like it would be so fun to control. But also, why is it like a claw game? No. Kay? No. If they open the shield gate, you can broadcast from the tower. Is Kay dying? Lock Okay. No. We love our sassy droids. Why do they always die? R two D two doesn't die, right? Don't spoil. And even if so, don't tell me. Oh God. This is too crazy. So they're going to have to climb the tower. Oh god, are these the big guns? Y'all gotta get out of there. <gasps> I want them to be okay too. Okay. Suddenly she's a skilled rock climber. That's terrifying. It's out there, that console. Guys, no, be careful. I'm going. No, I'm scared.
scared for them. I've got it. <gasps> okay? What? Oh my god, don't do that. I thought she dropped it. Oh, hello. Um, excuse me, I'm just doing a little bit of rock climbing exercising on your data tower. Okay, this guy's gonna do it, right? And he's not gonna die, right? Please? Oh no, I can't believe he's just walking in the middle of this. That's wild. I'm gonna be so upset if you guys. It's okay. He, he's one with the force. Mm, I'm gonna cry if something bad happens. Don't die. Don't die. Cassian! What? Oh god. Is he out for good? No. 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 It's because he wasn't chanting, I'm one with the force, the force is one with me. No. No. Oh, he's saying it. And I'm one with the force. Oh, no. How are you not getting shot, though? <laughs> so risky. No! I knew it! Bodhi! Are you freaking kidding me? I knew it. It's really rude how the likable characters keep dying. What was that? Why didn't the force work for him? No! No! at his friend while he was dying. That's so upsetting. I feel nauseous. That reminded me of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. The fans at the top when Charlie drinks the soda and he starts to float. Alright then. Wow, I can't believe it's just her now. Alignment. What? How am I supposed to do that? All the way out there? Oh yeah, nobody's gonna notice that. Oh my god. Ready to transmit. Okay, so people didn't notice? No, they did. Come on, you can do it. I hope. You. My father's revenge. He built a flaw in the Death Star. He put a fuse in the middle of your machine, and I've just told the entire galaxy how to light it. Nice. Who is that? How do you make it alive, bud? Let's go. I thought he was dead. Yay! Can you do it a little bit faster? That's a big satellite. Leave it. Yeah, leave him. Sir, we're detecting a massive object emerging from hyperspace. Oh, hello? No, are they gonna kiss? I'm not really for if there's some romance between them now, because that wasn't there the whole movie. And there doesn't have to be romance in movies. I'm at far when ready. What? No. Wait. What's going on? Rogue One. Oh my god. Okay, so that look between them was because they knew they were gonna die. Darth Vader. Or like Darth Stinky. Your father would have been proud of you, Jen. That's very true. 
Are they just like waiting for it to reach them? No. Oh my god, they are. That's like midnight mass when they're just waiting by the sunrise until they die. Wow. Okay, so they did send the message of the Death Star having a weakness, but they didn't survive. So that must set us up for future movies. Who's this? What's happening? <gasps> oh, here we go. <laughs> the way he's just using one hand. Oh my God. I am so excited for the next movies. Wow, you've got to pass it on. Yeah, I got away from you. How does that feel? Must feel bad. Who's Your this? Highness, the transmission we received. What is it they've sent us? <gasps> Hope. That's Leia. Oh my god. I've not seen her like that. The last time I saw her was in Obi-Wan and she was a child. Wow. Those last few moments. All right, y'all. Thank you so much for watching Rogue One with me. I said at the beginning that I didn't know what to expect and I'm actually really happy because even throughout the movie, I didn't know what to expect. It was really cool to meet Jen and see everything that she went through. And I thought that the movie was just going to be about her. I didn't think we would see Vader or Jedi at all. So that was just so exciting that we did get to see Vader. And especially at the end, we got to see him acting a little cuckoo as he tends to do. And we saw Princess Leia as well, which I've never seen her older than 10 years old because I've been watching in timeline order. So that is so, so, so cool. Again, I'm watching in timeline order, so next up will be the original trilogy, and I am so excited. I really hope you all join me for that journey, so if you haven't already subscribed, I would really appreciate that. And until I see you in the next video, I hope you stay hydrated, stretch your legs, please don't get arrested, and I will see you then. Goodbye!